Hello everyone, thank you very much for tuning in. My name is Jeffrey Stewart. I am the new Project First Director for Concord Fire Department. If you don't know what Project First is, I'm glad you're listening because we're going to talk about it. Project First is a grant from the state of New Hampshire that Concord Fire Department has secured to address the opioid overdose issue here in the city of Concord and eventually in our greater capital area. The project has four primary goals. The first is to provide education to both the public and first responders on substance use disorder, specifically opioid use disorder. The other goal is to reduce opioid overdose death by providing uh, naloxone kits or opioid overdose kits, and we're going to show those later in a few minutes on our screen, and to provide communication and collaboration between other agencies within the city to facilitate a person into treatment. So somebody who is suffering with opioid use disorder, substance use disorder that needs help, the emergency department may not be the right place for them or the best place for them. So we go ahead and work with that patient where they're at and try to get them into a treatment program to address their opioid use disorder and or their substance use disorder. And then the final component of the grant is to look at sustainability. So once this federal money goes away, how do we make the project continue and to serve our citizens here in Concord in the greater Concord area? So what I'd like to do at this time is just show you what a naloxone kit contains and we'll go from there. Well, excellent. Here is our opioid overdose kit. It's bright green zipper case, easy to see, easy to spot in an emergency. Inside the kit contains an instruction sheet as well as information, my contact information, how to get a replacement kit if you were to need it, but most importantly, the instructions on how to use it, a face mask if you had to do rescue breathing, a pair of gloves, body substance isolation, safety first, and of course, the naloxone. Now the brand name is Narcan, that's what a lot of people refer it to, but the actual generic name is Naloxone. You'll hear people use both names interchangeably. And inside this box are the individual doses. They're four milligrams each, it's done through a nasal spray, that's how it's administered, extremely simple to use. This is the Naloxone kit that we provide as part of this grant. There's a brochure in there as well that tells you more about Project First. And Project First, as I said, is an initiative from the state of New Hampshire through the federal government, SAMHSA specifically, and Concord Fire answered a community need. We know that Concord, the city of Concord and the greater capital area have a problem with opioids and opioid overdoses. We've shown that statistically, we demonstrate it, and the fire department chose to take on the responsibility of pursuing an avenue to assist and facilitate. And this is Concord Fire Department's recognizing a need within our community and responding to that need. And they pursued and obtained the Project First grant money. I've come on board and we're providing, like I said earlier, education to both first responders as well as the community at large. These naloxone kits, collaborative efforts to make sure that we get the patient who's suffering or a person at risk with opioid uh, use disorder into treatment. And of course, sustainability and that's just we want it to go on and be able to fund it after the grant funding expires. That's the goal. Here's the, the uh, opioid overdose kit. The question becomes, how do you get one? Pretty straightforward. Reach out and contact me. We will put our uh, contact information on the screen so you have our website, our email, and our telephone number. I'm at headquarters station over on 24 Horseshoe Pond Road, excuse me, Horseshoe Pond Lane here in Concord. My office is over there. I'm generally in the city of Concord, on, on duty, so to speak, five days a week, uh, 7 a.m. until around 5 p.m. However, anyone can get me 24-7. The department can reach me, the members on our department. We have some systems in play to get you a naloxone kit if you need it after hours, as well as help from an opioid use disorder. Of course, as always, if it's an emergency, life-threatening, police, fire, EMS emergency, call 911, utilize your 911 system. Our Concord Fire Department and EMS providers, remember in the city of Concord, the Concord Fire Department also provides your ambulance services. And these guys are well trained, they know what they're doing, they're well versed in opioid overdose utilization and treatment, and they can help you in an emergency, and then they can also give you my contact information and uh, we can facilitate you into our project first if you need. So if you're a person at risk and or you have a significant other family member who might be at risk, don't hesitate to contact us. Our information's on the screen. 
reach out. This is Concord Fire Department's way of responding to a community need, the opioid overdose crisis here in the city of Concord and the greater capital area. Thank you very much.